What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Scott Free, and this is The Sounds of Sunday. Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Scott Free, your host, producer of the Sounds of Sunday radio show. I'm bringing you back um, a show that I actually put on last weekend because I actually had some technical difficulties. I'm not sure what happened, but um, many of my, <clears throat> I guess my equipment or whatever didn't get out. Um, so you can view the show. Um, but anyway, I'm bringing you back that same show from November 1st, 2020 show. Um, on this uh, 2000, November 8th, 2020 show, um, basically Veterans Weekend and week coming up also, um, just give out, give a shout out to all my Marines out there uh, for our Marine Corps birthday coming up on November 10th this week, okay? Uh, so stay tuned. Coming up is a great show. Like I said, this is a repeat show of my last show on November 1st. Uh, because of technical technical difficulties, I'm bringing that show back right here on the Sound of Sunday. So stay tuned. Coming up is my R&B music mix right here on the Sounds of Sunday. Right back.
with respect and eyes and before that was one by Patrick Patricus with cover and kicking off this R&B music mix today was one by Slink and Stabilina with The Jam right here on the South of Sunday thank you for tuning in this afternoon on this November 8th 2020 show I'm actually um, up there like I said before, last weekend, I'm not sure what happened, but I had some technical difficulties with my show, so I'm bringing that entire show back uh, because I don't want you to miss that show. It was a pretty uh, pretty nice uh, show that I put on last weekend um, <clears throat> and bringing it back up this weekend, okay? 
So uh, coming up is my smooth jazz music mix right here on the sounds of Sunday. Right back.
Just coming back, that was a nice little cut by Nora at Blank B with True Art Real Affection Part 4. And before that was one by Asher Falero with Lukewarm Hazy. Nice little new cut uh, that I actually wanted to um, start promoting. Nice little cut. Uh, before that, you heard one by Young Logos with Memory Rain. And kicking off this uh, smooth jazz music mix was one of my favorites uh, by the Brothers Records with Sleeplessness right here on the Sound Sunday. Thank you for tuning in this afternoon on this November 8th, 2020 show. Um, like I said, this is a Veterans Weekend coming up to Veterans Day on the 10th uh, next week. So I want to actually give a shout out also. I'm also giving a shout out to all my Marines out there. Hoorah. December 5. Uh, we have a Marine Corps birthday coming up uh, this week, okay, on the 10th of November. So shout out to all my um, all my Marines out there. Stay stay up and stay strong, okay? Um, <clears throat> before I go on to my um, final um, mix for today, which is my international mix, I'm going to go over the um, national political agenda uh, sponsored by one of my good favorite content creators, uh, Brother T. West of Afro Synergy. Uh, shout out to Brother, Afro, Brother T. West. Uh, we are actually going through a election, uh, election week, election year right now. Uh, a lot of chaos going on, but <clears throat> I guess people are trying to um, call the uh, presidential election for Joe Biden, uh, which is actually go, got to go through a lot of hurdles and hoops right now because there's been... Um, evidence of fraud and um, <clears throat> misuse of ballots and um, other ballots showing up um, after the close of the uh, after the close of the time of the election. So all that's got to be straightened out by the Supreme Court. So um, everybody's actually celebrating right now. If I was you, I would actually um, not try to get into all the celebration right now because it's still got to go through the Supreme Court. Okay. Uh, work everything out. So, Biden win, congratulations. If Trump wins, congratulations. Okay. But anyway, this is the um, national political agenda. Uh, we're working on 15 and 16 right now. Um, 15 is uh, says the court and courts and police department must uphold the constitutional rights of African Americans, ensuring they are free from 9/11 calls solely based on racism. Okay. That can and has led to the death of African Americans. Very important. Okay, that's number fifteen. Number sixteen. Government must not use its police force in African American African American communities like an ATM machine, using police and court systems to supplement budgets. Okay, those are <clears throat> that's number sixteen. Now I'm just going to actually uh, for the, those of you who missed out on the uh, uh, coming up so far. Um, on the national political agenda, I'm going to do a recap, okay, from 1 through 16, okay, and uh, number one is the government study on the adverse effect today of slavery, Jim Crow and discrimination against African Americans, adverse effects on, adverse effect on establishment and accumulation of generational wealth and the monetary value of beneficiaries of slavery, Jim Crow and discrimination, okay. Number two is reparations is owed, okay? It's owed, all right? That's what we're pushing for. Reparations is owed and must be rendered to African Americans, descendants of those enslaved, beginning approximately in 1619 in a primarily British, French, and Spanish colony, ter colony territories and what would become the United States of America. Reparations, okay? So if the election may be swinging, it doesn't mean anything. We're still going for reparations. Uh, number three, to move reparations bill H.R. 40 into discussion and commit from committee to a vote in the full house. Okay, no longer is it sitting on somebody's desk. Number four is to produce produce a U.S. Senate bill equivalent to H.R. 40 in the house. Number five, hard work and free labor should be valued and rewarded, whether it started in 1619 or today. Number six, all citizens of the United States must have the right to vote and that right must be protected. Okay. <clears throat> Number seven, prison reform must include the right for ex-felons who have served their sentences, 
the right to vote in all states. Number eight, Constitution of the United States must be upheld. Okay. Number nine, federal laws of the United States must be upheld. Okay. Number 10, government should not intrude in affairs of African American families except where there are violations of the law. Number 11, the core of families are male, female, and children. Nothing less, nothing more. Okay. Number 12, life must be respected and protected at all points. <clears throat> I, I mean, that's unless you all actually want a civil war out here, which it seems like it's actually. Uh, Coming up to that point where civil unrest is going on because of this election. I'm not sure what's going on, but stay tuned. Number 13, education must be treated with the level of respect and importance of the military. Okay. <clears throat> Number five, with that, Marine Corps birthday coming up this week. And Veterans Day to all service members. Number 14, social and, welfare, social and welfare programs must be a means of social efficiency, not a lifestyle. Okay, You got a lot of people that's actually hanging on to welfare systems that should not be on there. Uh, when I was growing up, <clears throat> there were actually, um, in my community, there were actually people working at steel mills, Okay, getting all this money, and on top of that, um, getting welfare. Those days, those days should be cut out. Okay, No more of that. Okay, that's why the society is actually going down now, uh, because you got people pending on the welfare system when they should not be. Okay, those who need it are having a, a hard time, and those who should not get it should not be actually hanging on this welfare system. Okay, it's for American citizens only. Okay. <clears throat> okay, number fifteen. Fif uh, fifteen courts and police departments must uphold the con. Uphold the constitutional rights of African Americans, ensuring they are free from 9/11 calls solely based on racism. That can and has led to the death of African Americans. Okay, number 15. And coming up to the end of uh, this one today is number 16. Government must not use the police force in African American communities like an ATM machine, using police and court systems to supplement budget. Budget. Okay. What that means is basically. Um, Using the police for traps, um, uh, illegal stops, uh, allegedly illegal stops, um, stop and frisk, um, giving uh, uh, unwarranted tickets out there. I used to be a military um, uh, military official, and so I know the ins and outs of what's going on there. Uh, that people are actually, instead, especially in certain communities, are being targeted for a budget supplement. Okay, for the courts and the police departments. Okay, that no longer uh, cannot stand. Okay, <clears throat> unless you uh, unless you all actually want something serious uh, to come down the pike. Okay, um, and that's basically one through sixteen. Okay, next weekend we'll uh, bring up number seventeen and eighteen. Okay, deal with health care and government programs. Okay. Anyway, thank you for tuning in this afternoon on this November 8th, 2020 show. Uh, this is military, okay, Veterans Weekend, and we, coming up uh, next week on the 11th is Veterans Day. And also want to give a shout out to all my Marines out there, Marine Corps birthday coming up on November 10th, okay, this year. Uh, me and a couple of uh, friends, of Marine friends of mine, we went out and celebrated uh, Friday because, uh, Next week, it's going to be actually kind of, uh, I would say, not hectic, but uh, we just wanted to do it on the weekend instead of the weekday, okay? Anyway, coming up is my international music mix of the last music set of the day, and this one uh, is one by the Mini Vandals featuring Mamandu, Kuida, and Lasso with Burke. Birkin Electric, okay, right here on the South of Sunday. Like I said, this is a repeat show because last week uh, my show didn't get up because of technical difficulties, so I'm bringing my entire show from last week up today, up to today, okay? All right, so anyway, stay tuned for the International Music Mix coming right here on the South of Sunday. Right back.
get a drum as a toy for Christmas. He was one of the greatest innovators.
nice little cut by Sound of Partner with the Seventh Floor Tango. And before that, you heard one by another one by Quincus Morita. I always get that wrong. Uh, sorry about that, uh, Quincus Morita. And before that, you heard um, one by Freedom Trail Studios with Yards of Pain right here on the Sound Sunday. Thank you for tuning this afternoon. I am your host, Scott Free. Hope to see you all next weekend right here on the Sounds of Sunday. Later.